And P's Rookie of the Month, good for him. I remember when I got my first. That's really cool. Ladies and gentlemen, we back with the career of Henry the Blasian, who right now is doing that Darth Vader walk into the gym. After that sorry performance versus the Phoenix Suns yesterday, we were just not impressed. I want to make sure everybody in this gym is working on their jump shot, especially working on their rebounding, and how to switch on defense when Devin Booker is absolutely violating us. Where's Pascal Siakam? That is one man I was disappointed in. Look at Gary Trent Jr. in the gym. Y'all better be working to be all-stars here in Toronto. Otherwise, you can go be a superstar in Guangdong, China. Now, y'all know I'm not going to be someone that talks unless I'm in the gym, too. And when it comes to my jump shot, I talk about it a lot. And that's because I'm so proud of it, man. I mean, look, it's just so green. I am simply not missing anymore when it comes to this jump shot. Of course, when you're in the actual in-NBA game and your stamina is affected, that's different, but my catch and shoot game, it is lethal. The one thing I don't like about my career this year though, is my badges regressing. That just makes things so annoying, you gotta focus on so much, but just like that, easy drills done, baby. How have I not seen this before? This is a beautiful Kobe mural. Be legendary. I know the artist that designed this too. The man has insane work that he's shown on Twitter that he's done for 2K in the past and the present. You got this beautiful mural at the bottom as well with all his different achievements. That's what I have to do if I want to be the next Kobe Bryant. So the bar is set extremely high, ladies and gentlemen. Now, before we do continue with the main story, I did end up replying to the person that did win the Hall of Fame pass. So go ahead and get back to me. If you don't have a Twitter or Instagram, I'll find a different way to contact you and get you that Hall of Fame pass. And if y'all want me to do more giveaways, let's hit 2000 likes on today's video. Now, ladies and gentlemen, today we're in for something different. The family flashback humble beginnings trucks big break truck earns a permanent spot on the Celtics roster by shutting down magic Johnson in his first game as a pro if that's not a legendary start I don't know what is it's time to get into knowing more about our grandfather truck the blazing that sounds hilarious but let's get into it and I shouldn't have to put up with this. Cold Basketball Trump? Association. Trump. Oh, oh, that's my guy, TP. Hey, hey shout out to my boy, TP. The TV, National man. Basketball Association. You getting called up. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Now, let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Let it go. We out the G League, baby. Or wherever we are right now. So, you know you guard Magic tonight, right? Wait, With DJ what? and Cedric down, we need you to stay out of foul. February okay. Also, don't fall for his pump fake. That's an easy six. But you got to contest or it's lights out. All right. Hey, he's going to get his tonight, so don't let it frustrate this you. This is a big game for us. We need you to get down in the mud and scrap. Okay, I can also, do that. Also, hey, you're on a 10-day contract. That's a tough spot to be in. But it's also a good opportunity. So, you want to stick around? Show us what you got. Any questions? About guarding Magic? Good. See you at one. <laughs> Yo, they just put in the whole lo Oh, Larry Bird! Oh, and we got Robert. Yo, we got a super team. You got ML Carr right there as well. Where's Kevin McHale? Yo, they've got the vintage intro and everything. Oh, nah, this is fire. We back in 1984 for real. Y'all can see they've even got the era filter on. Now, I appreciate a good era filter, but... I don't know how long I can keep it on for because this starts to hurt the eyes after a while and I'm sure it's not going to be the most pleasing to you guys either. Let's play some defense here though. Good defense there, Bird. Yes, sir. My grandpa was really out here with a super team. Let's get Larry Bird in the post. Maybe he can show me his signature fadeaway. I'm not supposed to be someone that's hooping on this team. I'm just a nobody on a 10-day contract trying to hold down Magic Johnson. If Bird can carry our offense, that'd be great. Actually, speaking of offense... I don't even know what my jump shot looks like. Guard that up, guard that up. People in the 80s were not shooting threes like this. Magic already has an assist. Now the goal here is to hold him under 10 and five. If he goes over on any of those, I lose the three stars. I doubt I get the three stars in my first try, but we'll see. I know this is hard to ask, but I need spacing here, man. I know we're in the 1980s. Ah! Y'all have heard of Magic and Kareem. Oh my goodness, what a vintage freaking video transition there did y'all see that that's so funny but i was trying to say they might have show time but we got go time come on parish i don't blame you that is the greatest center of all time but you holding it down 
I really want to see what Truck's jumper looks like. Never mind. Kevin McHale? Is that McHale? Bro, I can't do it with these filters. No, I'll turn it off after the first quarter. We got to enjoy feeling like we're in the 80s, but I can't see a thing. Everybody jump. Good defense. We got the steal. Larry, roll with me. This ain't showtime. It's go time. He gets the bucket. I don't get the assist, but I don't care, man. We got to make sure we win this game. Oh, yeah. Bird against Magic. Oh, my goodness. Robert Parrish. Hit that screen. Hit that screen. There we go. Bird, go get you a bucket. Let's go. We got three assists. We're probably not going to do too much this game, but we've got the lead after the first quarter unless Magic can heave something crazy. Right now, he's got two and two. I'm going to turn that air filter off now so y'all can see and I can see, and hopefully we can hold him under three assists for the next three quarters. Lock it up, boys. Lock it up, Mikhail. That's what you love to see. I'm already running in transition. I'm running in transition. I'm throwing the ball up to Bird because it's not showtime. It's go time. It looks way better when the graphics are like this. I'm not going to lie to you. The air filter, I appreciate that they got that feature, but I just need to be able to see what I'm doing. I need help. This man is 6'9", and I literally can't do anything about it except put a hand up. There is no containing Magic Johnson. No! Oh my goodness, I got a stop on Magic! Oh my goodness, Bird got the stop! Let's go! It's go time! Not show time! Go time! Oh, Bird wants a screen. Bird wants a screen. Yup. Yup. Do your thing. Oh, that's the shot, Larry? That's the shot? They had Bob McAdoo? Bro, the Lakers were low-key a super team too. I had no idea. Y'all can see I got the sharpshooting takeover. I want to see if I can get some space. What that jumper look like? Oh! Yo! Truck got the stroke though. Huh? This is on Hall of Fame difficulty too. Yup, it's not showtime, it's go time. We just keep running. Oh, so Truck is actually getting benched. I did realize that it's only five minute quarters. We're up two at the half. Hopefully Magic is only on the floor when I'm on the floor. Good D, good D, good D me. Oh man, you can only do so much, man. He's definitely going to get his 10 points. But on the bright side, he has not gotten assist since that first quarter. So we're doing great there. I still got my take over here. So I'm going to see if I can get one more three off. Robert, I need a good screen from you, though. Thank you. Oh, they're, they're not respecting me. Oh, I see why. So since I'm essentially a paradox human being in this timeline, I wonder who I replaced. Oh, it's not showtime. It's go time. Because I'm pretty sure the Celtics had somebody else at point guard. Wasn't it Dennis Johnson? Is that why I look like Dennis Johnson? Magic, I just want to let you know that in like 30 years, somebody that can stroke that huh? thing from half court gets considered one of the greatest point guards of all time. So you better work on that jump shot. I'm out here trying to disrupt the timeline. Hold on. Pick and pop. Oh, yeah, bird. That's money. Greatest shooting oh, small forward of this time. Of this time. <laughs> Clamp. If Magic is hitting mid... What is that? What is that? <laughs> He's already got 10 points. I, I can't stop him. Bird wants the ball in the post. Get it to him in the post. Oh, they're fouling him and one. Ah, it's too bad. I was really hoping Magic and Larry would guard each other since these guys are, you know, eternal rivals. But as long as we win this game, man, I just got to hold Magic under 20 points to even get a star, which is all I'm trying to do at this point. I don't think this is feasible on Hall of Fame. Yep, hit that screen. Parish. It ain't showtime. It's go time. Damn, he really catches those. Look at that. Byron Scott, that is not your body. Yep, we hear rebounding. We are called Truck. If your name is Truck and you can't rebound, then what's the point? Hold that screen. Magic was not this good of a defender, by the way. Good pick and roll there by Kevin McHale, and he gets the bucket. Now, there's something that I found that low-key might be glitchy. We can run a 2-3 zone in the 80s. I'm pretty sure it wasn't allowed at this time. So, yeah. They got, like, what, one person that can maybe shoot? Look, we can just shrink the floor, and the computer goes out of bounds because he's so confused. It's like, what are these guys doing? We get put back on the bench. I guess coach didn't like my game plan. And we are up two points going into the fourth quarter. So, this is a tight game. Yeah, we're all sitting in the paint. We're getting stops. I should have ran this zone defense early. Look at 40%. Magic, listen, you are a phenomenal point guard. It doesn't matter what era you're in. Hall of Fame difficulty will piss you off all the way. Oh, there we go. Pop for me, Larry. Pow. 
Give me all three of those. Bro, our 2 3 zone got these guys in hell. They have no idea what to do offensively. I'm there. We foul him. It's a gritty game. This story is playing out exactly how I wanted to. The legendary pick and pop by Larry Legend himself. Give me those. Do they not know how to guard a pick and pop in the 80s? Clear it out, clear it out. Bird wants it. Oh, Magic's fouling. This man's getting desperate. He's like, hold on. Why is a man on a 10 day contract outplaying me right now? Magic, I know you're getting desperate. Hold the screen though. All the way to the basket. Finally drawing my first foul of the night. And we're gonna get to see what Truck's free throw looks like. Hopefully it's not like an underhand or anything. And it's actually fairly easy, but very, very slow. I low-key wish all my animations from my current player carried over, because that would make it so much easier. You're just jumping into a game with no idea of what animations you have. Good defense, good defense, good defense. We here. They don't have an answer for our zone defense. Look at Robert Parrish. Not letting the ball get to Kareem. I love that. They need a timeout. 53 seconds, man. We need to win this game. This was Truck the Blazers' moment. His NBA moment. And he took it. And he made it. Truck the Blazers in the clutch. He's on a 10-day contract, and it doesn't matter. This is his legacy. Do not let the ball get to Kareem. Do not. Good defense. Oh my goodness. Magic really threw a lot. Kareem's like, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm clapping him. I'm clapping him. I'm clapping him. He's trying to dribble into me. Oh my goodness. He's going to make that. He's not. He's not. Oh my goodness. They're choking. They're choking. They don't know what to do. That's game. That's game. That's game. Five seconds and it doesn't matter. That's game. Shoot it, Byron. Let's go! I'm pretty sure that's going to be two stars for us. So not quite three stars. Magic was not getting any assists in that second half. We held it down. I should have probably played a zone defense to start, but hey, Truck the Blasian's legacy. Wow, Truck, impressive game. Gee, thanks, Johnny. So walk me through this. It's your first taste of NBA action. Uh -huh. You've got to take on Magic Johnson. Uh -huh. You actually get the best of him. Oh, it feels really good. It's the Blazing Legacy. Like Magic is one of the best to ever do it, but I can defend anyone. This is my game. So after Yo, my grandpa was like him. Tonight, do you think that you've shown the team enough to secure your spot on the permanent roster after your 10-day contract is up? Obviously. I hope so. Not the flashiest guy to do it, but I can defend at a high level, and I'm going to do it no matter where I am in that rotation. The only yeah, thing I don't like about this history is that win, like my grandpa's a Celtic. Y'all know we don't like the Humble, Celtics. Hardworking, straightforward. Thank you, Chuck. An unbelievable performance. Chuck the Blade, man. Who would have thought? Tonight, the Celtics defeat the Showtime Lakers here in Los Angeles. Uh huh. I'm Johnny Ryan. Back to you in the studio. Bravo. Your grandpa was ready for anything. Didn't matter what he was up against. That man had ice water in his veins. <laughs> I still can't believe he's gone. Like, every day something will happen that'll make me want to call him and, you know, I <gasps> remember. I know, I know. But you know you can still learn from him, still honor him. And yeah. when your number's called, you gotta be ready. It could be game seven of the NBA Finals instead of, you know, game 40 of the regular season, but you're only going to have one shot. I still don't know why my dad's dressed like that. Just like Grandpa only had one shot to even make an NBA roster. Why is my shirt vibrating like you that? You honor his legacy. You make the most of those chances whenever and wherever they come. Facts. Uh, that's real, Pop. Well, I know a few things. <laughs> you should. You old, man. <laughs> Not so old that I can't back you down in the paint and show you what's up. What oh, is under oh, my sure? shirt? It's yeah, ruining sure. this you moment. The leg day and it shows. Look at the little chicken oh, legs. No, 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 hold on. Well, that's not my legs, bro. Day, so, oh my mm -hmm. gosh, what is sure. in my pants? Better hit the weight room before you step to me. You know what? I'm ready. We can hit it right now. You ready, old man? <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, let's do it. You gonna spot me? <laughs> I'm about to give my dad the work. Huh? So I got something vibrating in my pants, and it huh? also looked like. I got veneers on. I mean, let's check out Truck the Blazing stats here. 
8, 1, and 10, which again, against Magic Johnson, off a 10-day contract, not too bad. You guys will see with the VC here, 1.6 multiplier to show y'all that we got this done on Hall of Fame. Wait, I got no VC for that? I'm probably gonna try to get the three stars at some point because I need to perfect this game, but overall, the family flashbacks is cool, especially because it's got that little story within it. I can't wait to unlock the rest of these. It's definitely gonna be a good time. We're gonna have to play more of our career here, and we've got another game versus Donovan Mitchell coming up, and that's a key game. How far is that? Bro, that is like a month away. They just want you to skip through the regular season or what? We're definitely going to play some regular season games leading up to cooking Donovan Mitchell once again, but I think we're going to leave it at just that for a side quest for today. Next episode, we'll be jumping into more NBA games, more street games, getting better, and hopefully y'all enjoy this life. That is Henry the Blasian. Take care.